Lesson three, medical test. Your body has several biological aspects involved in your sports practice. And at the same time, you can discover any deficiency that might stop you, like high or low blood pressure or the proportions in your body, anemia or any other problems. It's important to get it on time and addressed with the medical professionals before it becomes a problem. Biological aspects are playing a big role in your sport practice. We need to know how the body is developing. As you see in the next card, we put the anthropometric measurements. You need to put your team or your sport, the name and the age. You need to put every part right there. I put all the body parts, the most important body parts, and in the first test, you need to put the measurements. Measure your head, especially if you are a teenager. The head grows. The neck, the shoulders, all the circular around the shoulders. Don't open your arms. Your arms need to be close to your body. The flex arms, that means it's the biceps, the forearm, the wrist, the arm in the long way from the shoulder to the fingertip, the chest, all around your chest, your waist, your hips, your thighs, your calf, legs the long way, and the thighs and the calf the right and the left. And put a note right there is the right is the left. That's why you put more space in the thighs. How long is your feet? One feet is longer than the other. I guarantee you, you will find out. And body fat index, if you have access to one of those calipers, give you the how much body fat you have. You need to go to a personal trainer and they will give you the measurement. Because they need to test several parts of your body and make uh, the average. When you have all this one, we need to go to the biometric and the biometric, I recommend to check every month. You cannot do it every two months, but the height, the weight, the pulse, the body temperature, you should have an idea and put a line right there, put before and after practice to check how the temperature is raising up when you practice. The blood pressure, the same, try to put it before and after practice. The count of the red cells. If you have access to laboratories, just check your cells, your red cells. Check your hemoglobin and the white blood cells. If you have vision problems, put it right there. Your hearing, if you hear correctly. And the stress test. It's as when you go into the treadmill for 10 minutes and they check all the measurements, put the number right there. You have access to the spirometry and recovery test. After you do the stress test, you need to check how much take you to recover. Good. When you have these two on track, take several copies. You will make history of what you want to do. When you go to college or you're already in college, when you have five years of history of what you're doing, your value as an athlete grows, increases tremendously because you have proof of everything, what you was doing. All right, the next session, the session number four, is the skill progression. I will see you over there and we'll talk about the progression.